So check out this beauty that I just picked up this morning. It is a 1983 RCA video disc player. And the story that I got is that it's been in storage since it was brand new. Never has been used at all. I don't even know if it works. Still has the owner's manual. Check this out. The cord is still wrapped up the way it would have been in the box, brand new. So it has never been used whatsoever. It's a little dusty, but for the most part, it is super clean. Now you can see September 1983. Model SJT100, and it is in amazing condition. All right, so now I've got it hooked up to the TV. Still haven't plugged it in. So here it goes. Now this is my first video disc player. So this is gonna be a new and exciting thing. Use it for the first time. Let's see if we can get it to power on. Plug it in. Push the power button. It is doing something. They don't seem right though. So it looks like the problem is I've got a belt over here that has like dry rotted and is not currently working. Well, it's gone, it's missing. So of course the thing's not gonna work without a belt. So let me see if I got any replacement belts, throw it on, see what happens. So I took out the wheel that had the belt on it. As you can see, it gets mushy. It's kind of gross. So I'm gonna take that off and I've got a replacement one. I'm gonna put on it and then see if we can put it back on, see what happens. All right, let's see what happens now when we power it on. Ooh, we got some movement. Oh, I powered it off. Power it on. It's spinning now. Looks to be working. Oh! Bam! Just like that. We have basically a brand new video disc player it's about to play friday the 13th part two <laughs> oh it's awesome where's my remote let's turn it up Here it is loading, so I'm gonna put the video disc in there. It takes it, removes the disc from the sleeve. And there it goes. Takes a little bit of time, boom.
Oh my gosh, I love it. That is amazing. Hell yes. All right, I'm just going to watch the movie now. So I'll talk to y'all later.